You gotta be kidding me. Hey, you are nothing. I'm the host of this show. Ladies and gentlemen, it's no surprise that we have coming up on May 26th the detention at the Olympic Auditorium. And Chapel, how are we gonna get the game? Well, of course, Saturday night, May the 26th, XPW returns to downtown Los Angeles at the Grand Olympic, the, the historic Grand Olympic Auditorium. Of course, tickets are available through Ticketmaster, 213-480-3232. You can go to Ticketmaster.com, or of course, at all Ticketmaster locations now. Tickets are also available through the XPW box office, 818-755-8757, or you can come to the XPW box office itself, 11133. Van Owen Street in North Hollywood, and of course, xpwrestling.com with the credit card. And you say it right, Chico, the Olympic Auditorium World Famous Store, 18 and Grand, Richmond 9, 517. Oh no. Cosmo Larry. Hey, hey, snap out of it, buddy, come on. The, the revelation is coming. The revelation, Chico, for the redemption is coming to my head. I'm, I'm seeing it. Can you believe it? It's going to be an incredible night at the Olympic Auditorium, May 26th. And wrestling fans, you are going to want to stick around tonight. Don't go anywhere. Because all kind of action coming your way. We got Pogo the Clown. And White Clutch, Johnny Webb with Jessica Clutch in the middle of the ring. Also, a big, violent crap field. Extravaganza, as we see, Bishop's Big Grimes take on the Frankenstein Union, Supreme. And also, now this, put on your seatbelt, Chico. There's no seatbelt there. What are you talking about? On the XPW Mayor Gun. Oh! Mayor Gun video. Debut right here tonight. So stick around. Don't go anywhere. XPW TV coming at you.
at the footage of Johnny Webb at the Olympic Auditorium that is seen only crying as he is on the microphone, speaking nonsense. ¿Lo viste ahí? Yo no, yo no entendía lo que decía él. Estaba, está loco, emborrachado, está. Ladies and gentlemen, the Olympic Auditorium, XPW, we are here, and there he is, and look at it, teetering back and forth, no question, oh, no. no question, no no question that Mr. Webb is drunk already. Probably hitting the old Jack Daniels once again, Webb. Yeah, what is he doing? Of course, accompanied by the lovely, beautiful, all the beautiful, with Jessica Dyer. Oh. Now, did you vote for her, for the ex-girl of the year, Rivera? Who did you vote for? You know, Chick, I have to tell you every once in a while that me and the Jessica Daniel we sneak off. What? To, to a beach. Wait, does in, Webb know about this? In Ventura. For a little cure for real Hey, maybe next time I can, uh, maybe a little, uh, you know, I, I can, I can go. And, and then after the food, tell her that I... Chick, after the food is finished, some tango lesson. Some what? Tango. Look at, look at, look Hi, at. everybody. Hi. It's me, White Trash John Webb. Yeah, hi, Mid Johnny. Mid-quarter for life. You know why? Because there's a conspiracy against me. A C-O-N. Conspiracy. The Messiah. Keep sucking me. Sabu keeps sucking me. They won't give me the match I deserve. And, and I blame it all. I blame it all on um, on George W. Bush and and little green men that, that only pick on rednecks like me. And um, and what else? And. Uh, and I blame it on that, on that, on that giant thing that attacked the Messiah last time. What the hell was that? Hey, that guy was like seven foot five or whatever. He need to wipe that crap off his face and work on his free throws. Is what he need to do. He's a big boy, wasn't he? Whatever. Anyway, just to recap, Green Man, George W. Bush. And, and a really big tall guy, and a really big tall guy, yeah, yeah. You understand, you understand and, uh, what he's saying, Chick? Definitely. And uh, Rick McCusson, 44D. And that one ahead. Yeah, and I need more Vicodin. And, um, and the beer in this place is still expensive. Oh, Jessica. Oh, the and, and that's about oh, it. Continuous. So who the hell are they giving to? Mid-car John and Webb tonight, I would like to know. Let me see. Give it to me. Bring it what up. What the hell was Let's that go. all about? Who's going to be? Is he possibly I'd like to know that. Man, he is definitely drunk. Get to turn the audio off. These people paid to come in here. Borracho for George, Patias, Bruce. This Who knows guy. what else? Probably sitting at home in front of the trailer with the lawn flamingos. Wait a minute. I hope he's not influencing oh. the rest of the XPW locker room Rivera, with his action. Get ready for who's coming out right now. Whoa, baby, Pogo the Clown! You know the music. What a contrast of style in this match! Contrast of style, I should say. We're both in the Pogo fan club always in full force. For 420, oye, oye, tremenda, tremendo sign over there, Cliff Cross, you see that? But let's get away from that, let's get to the fact that Pogo the Clown is one of the most iron, limber, big men in the pro wrestling business today. You're definitely right, Rivera, I mean, Pogo the Clown has shown us so much here in XPW, not only, of course, with the strength and the sheer size, but I mean the agility, the fast-paced wrestling technique, I mean, Pogo the Clown really has got it all. And you know, I have to admit, Pogo the Clown was my favorite for taking the 2001 XPW King of the Deathmatch Tournament trophy home with him that night. Of course, it went to Vic Ryan, but he was my pick for the, this guy.
This guy's going far next Well, that shows, that shows how smart you are, chick. Would you say, at least I picked somebody. At least I didn't. Well, I'll tell you at who I, I picked, chick. I picked Big Guy. Yeah, yeah, right. And just like, the, just like all the bandwagon fans out there in professional sports, look at this. White trash Johnny Webb doing the smart thing, taking it to the big man with his kendo stick. Right off the bat, Johnny Webb. The bigger they are, the harder they fall, and Pogo is down. Webb laying in, he doesn't know his own strength, he's, he saw it borracho. Whoa, look at that! See that right on the chin, high impact, as the head meets the chin, did it, did Beautifully executed. And this is, what white, Hi, Webb. this is what white trash Johnny Webb has to do, Rivera. He's got to take Pogo down and keep him down in the early goings of this match. And thus far, very successful at doing so. With the kendo stick once again, cracks it on the back of the head of Pogo the Clown, the big man. Now maybe Pogo, Pogo knows what it's like when he swings that chop. Whoa! Oh, oh. Did you hear that close? Did you see that close line? That was, a, that was a bone, bone chilling, bone rattling. Close line. I, I mean, what it. force? I feel it even in my bone. What, Bro. what, what quickness from Pogo the Clown, the quickness and the power. Big. Out of nowhere, Rebecca. Big clown. What a persivalous athlete he is. Oh, look at this. Elbow right to the right to the throat area of White Trash, Johnny Webb. Looks like Paul has been watching some Japanese tape as he's throwing that quick snap whiplash type. Manu, are you saying that Pogo is aligning himself with Gurin Tai? I'm not saying that, but maybe he's falling under the influence of them, you know, Chico. It's only, you only strive oh, look at this. to be as good as to competition and peers. You know what I'm talking about? Pogo the Clown with the gorilla press there drops Johnny Webb like a bad habit as Webb is still down. And look, it didn't take long, Rivera, for Pogo to turn this match around into his favor. Of course, he dropped him like a bad habit, but the condition that Johnny Webb is in right now, he might as well be a sack of potato. He is definitely drunk. Big overhead, a scoop, a slam. You saw there, done by, by Pogo, almost threw Webb out of the ring. And look at the strength. It was like he was picking up nothing, Rivera. And Webb, like you said, clear to the near side of the ring. Thrown by Pogo the Clown over his head. Oh, look at this. What's coming up here? Oh, don't tell me. Face Buster coming up. On, he nailed him. Pogo the Clown. Just taking it to White Trash Johnny Webb. And why is White Trash Johnny Webb, he knows he has a wrestling match. Why the hell would he get drunk before a match? I mean, this talk about stupidity. You know, sometimes people get nervous. And they, hey, look who's going, hey, you play a chico, Louis Cypher. What the hell is he doing here, Louis Cypher? The estranged husband of Jessica. A pelon. And look at White Trash getting thrown out. Oh, wait, what the hell is Cypher doing? This creep. Damn it. Who the hell is Henchman? Hey, look, Cypher, one of his, his sidekick. One of his henchmen coming out here. They got Jessica. They're only going with Jessica. Rivera. The hell is Cypher doing? And Webb's going right after him. Chico, what's happening with this organization? Jessica's gone. People, people are getting kidnapped. Every every show, there's kidnapping. And what is this? That the FBI chip on this show. Pogo the Clown does not know what to make of this. I don't know what to make of it. And White Trash Johnny Webb has been counted out. Pogo the Clown wins by a count out. Nonetheless, a victory this week for Pogo the Clown over White Trash Johnny Webb. But what the hell was that loose cipher and his henchman coming up to basically kidnap Jessica? Louis Cypher. Louis sick. Louis once again that every time he makes his present, no, no, I, I expedo event, something big happens, something that time, disaster like takes place. This guy is nothing but bad news. Come in. Okay. All the teachers.
teachers, and we got the greatest teachers in the world. And these guys, they suck, okay? They suck. How, what can you do with a five foot two, 140 pound kid? What are you do with them, huh? Oh, you got your killing me, please. Please. A bird, a bird flies. That just flies, all right? You got a teacher, the bird, the bird teaches she's a chick to fly, it flies. Teacher's great. They suck. Can't learn. It's like rain men out there. Let me say about the day. What? First, trying to pack up my office, trying to move everything. White fresh down your web, stumbles into the old Lightwell address. Completely drunk. I mean, what else is it? No. No, I'm just saying, this is like abnormally drunk. Rambling about how he never got his shot for the uh, King of the Death Match title, and how he wants his shot, he's take it out on me again, and he got it. Yeah, but, but he lost his shot. Didn't he? Well, he won the match uh, with Supreme when Supreme was Lester, but then Supreme came back as, as Supreme, and Supreme beat him. Right, tough, so. Well, but that match wasn't for, like, a contender, so technically, technically, he's, like, the contender. Uh, okay, well, I mean, you do what you want, you're the boss, I'm just saying. Okay, so give, give him another shot, give him a, a shot, a death match, give him a death match. Put him in that match, and if he wins, he gets a shot to the side. Right? That's good. All right. Good. Next. Make everything so difficult. Very strange phone call. Uh, apparently, Vampiro and the Insane Clown Posse are coming here at XPW, and I don't like the sound of that. Vampiro. Yeah. And, and from the clown. Yeah, the clown. They're so they 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 rapping guys. All right, so what are you worried about? You don't think it's a little strange? I mean, we break someone's ankle, all of a sudden people start coming out of the woodwork. Uh, they're coming here with them, for us. Dude, and take Carl Posse, musicians, they love wrestling. Let me tell you something. You know what they love more? Pornography. That's what they love. Dirty, filthy pornography. Come here for us. Van Piro knows this is the place to be. He ain't going to WWF. He didn't take him. You know? He's coming here at XPW. This is the place to be. All right? He's going to help us get rid of that camel jockey. All right? And it's over. He's with us. What are you worried about? Relax. Take a value or something. Uh, it's a feeling. All the right. feeling. What? I don't know. I don't know. It's a feeling. Is that it? Are we done? That's it. All right. I'm, 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 and I'll go tell Webb about his Tell Webb he's match. got his match. But it's, if he wins, he fights Messiah, and not this show, because this show's match. Next show. Okay. He has it. Sign it up, he's got it. All right. And don't worry about that, the, the posse thing. You're such a pussy. I cannot believe this Lewis Cipher coming to the ring during White Crash Johnny Webb's match and basically kidnapping Jessica. I mean, this is not the first time this has happened either. Her estranged husband, Lou Cipher, coming to the ring. I mean, this guy's not satisfied, obviously, until someone gets killed. This guy's sadistic, and someone's got to put a stop to him. I can't believe it. Fran, no surprise that this Louis Cipher is a mental psychopath that should be strapped in a hospital bed in Camarillo, some place, chick. He took the Johnny Webb Chamaquita on the shoulder, him and the, the, his sidekick. They took her, who knows? Who knows what she ended up, chief? Yeah, yeah. Hey, hey, uh, Rivera. Oh, ah. <clears throat> when are we going to see the footage? Well, what, what are you talking about footage? You know, the, the, the major video. What? I, what are you talking about? I have no idea what... The video of all major guns! Ha ha ha! Major gun video? Yeah, when are we going to see it? Come on, man, come on! When are we going to see it, Rivera? Come on! Okay. Come on! I want to see the major video right now! Right now! Wow. Wow. Wow.
I'm just cleaning my office. Come on in. Hello. What are you doing here? Kevin, you know why I'm here. Remember that last little situation? I'm not here to friggin' deal with all this crap. You know why I came to the show last time. My fans wanted me there. Guys in the locker room wanted me there. A lot of people were expecting a lot of things. And I don't know what this little Lizzie Borden's problem is, but you know, I like to have her face to face the next match. Listen, I don't know if I can do that. Remember, you weren't invited to XPW. Rob Black didn't invite you, Lizzie Borden didn't invite you, and now you want her face to face? Remember what happened last time? Yeah, I remember last time. And nobody messes with me like that. So, you remember what happened to you last time? But, yeah, let's not have that happen again. I'll tell you what. You give me what I want on May 26th, or you'll really see what will happen to you, little boy. Because you don't mess with me. And neither is that little Lizzie Borden. So, May 26th, you better make sure I get what I want. Her and I. Okay? That's all I have to say. I'll, uh, I'll see what I can do. Wow! Oh gosh, that's all I have to say. <laughs> did, did you did you see see the size of those of of, of, of those lenses? <laughs> the the lenses they were using. I, I'd like to give them a, a spit shine. <laughs> oh, Chico, let me tell you something, man. If I were you. I would not twist falling over my tongue over this hell with whiskey. La tienen que tener amarrada al piso para que no se vaya flotando en el aire, bro. But I'm telling you, relax, chico, or you are going to fall under the rack. Under the what? The rack? The rack. Oh, the rack. Of the wife, of the boss, chico, Lizzie boy. If you don't watch what you're doing, remember, Lizzie boy is responsible for getting rid of over half a dozen of the SPW women. So keep in mind, and don't cross the wife of the bat, the boss. Rivera is Lizzie Warren, Chief. Rivera, I think there's an exception. Yeah. I think there's an exception when it comes to the major guns. Oh, and speaking of major guns, folks, on XPWrestling.com, oh, this Monday, I've, I've just gotten word trying to compose myself here. Uh, that this, did I say this Monday already? This did Monday, I, I Lune, said, Lune. Yeah, yeah, I said it already, okay. Uh, this Monday I got word from uh, Tony T, the man who puts it all together on XPWrestling.com that new photos of major guns will be available, available, available this Monday at XPWrestling.com, so check it out. New photos of major guns. Did you say no? Huh? No photo? No, 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 man. Nude? No, man. No, man. You gotta, you gotta claw, uh, unclog the old ears. Nude photo. I said new photos. But you know, you, you never knew. Never yeah. mind that, chick. Forget about this, man. You're gonna get your head back in the ground, back into the TV show. In the rest, where we are right now, wrestling fun. When we come back, we're going to see the beginnings of a new but already extremely bitter fuel, as vicious big guy at the pizza corner. Hey, get in the ring with Frankenstein Jr. Supreme, right here on the XPW TV. Introducing first, from the Southside Sanitarium in Oakland, California, Vicious Vic Grimes! Look at the size of Grimes. Look at that. And that's, look at this image. This view is a good way to compare. Compare the, the, the size. Man the the two. from Hollywood, California, he is the human horror film Supreme! Oh yeah, listen to him, Rivera. Listen to this crowd here in Los Angeles. Give it up. Give it up for Supreme. And I know you're rooting for the other guy. Well, Chico, you know, 
the Bishop's Big Grand is a part, a soldier, for the Robert Black establishment, the Army Chick. Brown nosing. That has made the appearance tonight, and we continue to make the appearance tonight as the quest for domination continues. And look at the stare down, the third man in the ring, Patrick Hernandez, senior official here next PW as these two shove up. You heard the timekeeper. Wow, big slap. The timekeeper ring the bell. This match is underway as these two going at it with one another. Supreme. Back up for it. Give and take, Chick. Off the ropes now. Vic Grimes with a shoulder button. Look at that. Supreme didn't even move, Rivera. Supreme's going for one himself. And Vic Grimes didn't even move. And look at the smile on his face. Close line duck underneath. Vic Grimes. Close line another duck underneath by Supreme. Oh, and Supreme just levels Grimes. Ruda, close line. As the fan here, very, very intent in their concentration. As they watch as these two beasts try to gain control. Supreme now with the upper hand in this matchup continues with the forearms and the fists right to the head of vicious Vic Grimes, member of course of the Raw Black Army this year's King of the Death Match Tournament winner as Grimes goes down again, lands right on the back of his neck. And you know what, Chris Claus, it's going to be hard for you to stop the memory in my head from coming. Every time I'm sitting in this building, Chico, I can't stop the flood of the memory that coming in my head. Right now, this is reminding me of the old days, the matches between 600 pounds, Haystack Calhoun, and the man Mountain Mike. How old are you? Two big behemoth, Chico. Like, they had to, to fortify the ring, put another two, 300 pounds of cement in the ring so it don't slide around. Supreme and Grimes now on the far side, going at it with one another. Belly to back suplex coming up. Oh, look at that. Supreme goes down Beautiful. with authority. The strength of Vic Grimes lifting Supreme up with the ease, Rivera. Vic Grimes showing some, some technique, knowledge of, of actual wrestling. Well, history was made back then, Rivera, but I got to say, history is being made today. And today, XPW, the newest proving ground in professional wrestling with a huge crowd here in the City of Angels. As Vic Grimes scoops up in a slam, Supreme goes down again. Oh, drops the leg. Big body slam. And Big Grimes exhibiting some ballet-like maneuver there with that spinning leg drop. Nicely executed by Vic Grimes. Only got the two count right there. Ballet. Supreme just sneaking out the back door. It's ballet. Spelled with a T, but it's... Big ballet. Rivera. With a T. Once again, Vic Grimes scoops up Supreme. <laughs> And, what, and plants him, just drives him down to the canvas. I can't believe this big grind going from the high altitude all the way to the side rope. Supreme going upstairs, you're exactly right, Rivera. Look, Look at this. Oh, he connected. Another memory, Chico. Memory number two for tonight. John Tolos knee drop from the top rope. As Vic Grimes with the loaded knee pad. Just hit Supreme right in the chest cavity with that elbow drop from the top rope. And Supreme is still down. What's that? The, the famous Aieta Red. Time to go, Papa John. The piece of God, Chief. Papa John, numero uno, take your pick. Here it comes. Oh, no. Oh, no, look at this. He's going after the head of Supreme on oh, the blood. The blood flowing down. Did you see that, Rivera? Mira ahí, mira ahí lo tienen. Ladies and gentlemen, ahí lo tienen. Está poniendo un, lo que se usa para cortar una pizza. Thus far, uh, Está cortando la cabeza con una, con una pizza cutter, Chief. Pizza cutter, I heard you the first time. Larry Rivera, thus far, uh, to my surprise, Vic Grimes, surely dying. Ay, mira, mira. Match, look at this. Oh, no. Eso. Oh, not again. Look at all this. You see the blood, Rivera, just flowing. Just flowing down the forehead of Supreme. Ponle pepperoni ahí en la frente, bro. Look at the size of that cut, Rivera, on the forehead of Supreme. Oh, look at that. Insult to injury is... Vic Grimes stomps away on the already bloody Supreme right Come on, on that Supreme. cut. Huge cut Come from on, the pizza cutter. On the head. Uh, oh, no. Hey, no, please. No, no, no. no. Ah. Rivera, get the, get the barf bag if you're going to be sick. This violent crap, Chico, too much for me, man. Vic Grimes. I long for the days of Jack Brisco. Dirty phone, you, Chico. Vic Grimes That's the days. pulling out all the stops in this match. He doesn't give a damn. Supreme suffering. These, this is it. Both King of the Death Match tournament winners going at it one on one. Wow. Oh, and Vic Grimes. Oh, oh, you see that shot right to the groin. Ooh. Supreme. Not only that, you see the way the leg is stretched. 
possible hang a string injury. Hamstring injury, you're right, Rivera. For, for, for big grind. And Supreme, what presence of mind he had right there, just barely at the last second, catching Vic Grimes in the groin area. Referee and Patrick Hernandez trying to make sense here. As the tide seems to be turning now in this match in favor, of course, of Supreme. Oh, look at this. Supreme's got the pizza cutter. And look at this. What's good for the goose is good for the gander. The, the, the good, the what? Yeah, that's the right way to say it. Never mind, man. Never Burn mind. The pitch. Would you stop it? Rivera, look at this. Supreme With the pizza. Now, oh. Supreme now in the post. Now he lost the pizza cutter, too. The pizza cutter went flying outside of the ring onto the ringside area here at the Olympic Auditorium. Maybe some lucky fan will take that home and use it on his own. Gino's frozen pizza. Huh? Irish whip to the far side. Oh, and Vic Grimes got that boot up. Flush right to the job, Supreme. And now it's Grimes going upstairs. Vic Grimes from the top. Look at this. Oh, wow. flying clothesline. And Supreme goes down. These two big men giving it, the, giving it their all in this matchup. You know what, Chico? You have to put Vic Grimes in the same club as Polo and two as big men that have the agility to get on the top rope, fly high, I fly high, right? I high fly. Don't forget the fly John, high. Don't forget John Cronu. Cronu, John Cronu in that club too. Rivera. Oh, look at this to the near side and Grimes. Grimes got that knee right in the face. Supreme tried to duck out of the way. And lucky for Grimes, his knee connected it looked like. Grimes from the top. Oh! Headbutt right to the groin. He's big grind. He's, if Angel were out here, he would possibly call that the quickie licky. This is unbelievable. What a match. Oi, what are you talking about, Angel? Now you know something we don't know, Chief. I am telling you. Oi, get, get the air high. I'm scooting away. Don't hold any house. secret. You're getting a little excited. Oi, Ruth. Tranquila. Supreme on the near side. Just barely so lifeless. Oh, and he barely got out of the way, but Grimes. Grimes knew what he was doing, it looked like. He knew Supreme was playing possum, perhaps. However, Supreme, with the upper hand in this match right now, big continuing Grimes. to wail away at Vic Grimes, the big man. Big Grimes smelling the blood. Irish with reversal to the far side. Supreme just barely gets out of the way as Grimes goes for a high cross body, and he missed. Big Grimes, Chico, is like a chart. A gray white and chart, Chico. He smelled the blood. Sure, like the chalkboard? He, he smelled the blood from five. 100 mile away. Oh, look at this. And Don't tell me, Supreme. No, no. Wow. You see the way he, he's landing on his head. Landing on his head, a giant pescado. Giant pajaro. Cool to see of Supreme. Do you see that? That was like a mutation, Chico, of the 500 pound bird flying through the air. Supreme, an incredible bull look. He is standing up. And now Supreme again. Nothing happened. Look at this. Big apple. Supreme measuring Grimes. Oh, and he nailed him. Cactus style of the apple, chick. Supreme, Big Grimes, both on the outside of the ring. And look at the blood flowing down Supreme and Big Grimes. Both, both men coloring in, in La Sangre, oh, the crimson, crimson mask. La Mascara de Sangre. Referee Patrick Hernandez on the outside checking out both men. Of course, both these men been through a lot in this matchup. And how long has this match been going? Five, ten minutes. And look at look at the action, Rivera. Big kick by Supreme to the midsection. This is a no count Sailing. match. Big guy. Irish whip. Oh, look at that. Right into the ring post. Supreme with his left shoulder. Caught it flush. And now they're fighting amongst the ringside area still. Big Grimes, what the hell does he have in mind here? Going for a suplex, it looks like. He's going for the suplex, but where's he going to land? That's what I was thinking, it's Rivera. No, no, no stratega, me thinking. Mr. Big Grimes, use your you cabeza, the brains. Big Grimes, blood flowing from the head. Supreme blood flowing from the head. And this is nuts, Rivera. Where else would Once the blood again, be this flowing? Is no disqualification, no count-out match. As Vic Grimes drops the leg on the back of the neck of Supreme. And Supreme goes crashing down on the concrete floor here at the Grand Olympic Auditorium, downtown LA. As usual, Chico, the violent crap consisting of about 
65% outside the ring, I'm 35% inside. Is that the figure, 65, 35? That's about, that's that my, my okay, calculation, right? Chico, and I've been watching this violent crap. Oh, look at that, right into the security railing. Goes, oh, look at that, Grimes misses Supreme, just barely got out of the way as Grimes went head first into that security railing. Supreme with a chase oh, You see the force? Did you hear it? The power. Supreme is crazy. Supreme throws a chair inside of the ring now. As he is definitely in control of this match at this point in time. Supreme now with two chairs in the ring. And Vic Grimes just barely trying to get to his feet. Three chairs. Look at this, Rivera. It's getting to be... Wait a minute, four chairs. A little junkyard inside that ring. Junkyard? Junkyard. Patrick Hernandez. It's almost not not necessary for the referee Chico just to count the one, two, three. Exactly right. He is there for the three count. Five chairs. What the hell does Supreme have in mind? A PTA meeting, Chico. Six, seven, eight. Oh no, no, no. Just five. Just five. For the PTA little, meeting. For his little boy. What the hell are you talking about? I, I, I don't what know. What does Supreme have in mind here? Look at this, Vic Grimes. Supreme, with all that time setting those chairs up in the ring, gave Vic Grimes time to gain some composure and get himself back together, and that's what he's doing right now as he's taking it to Supreme. Oh, no, look at this. Supreme possibly setting up his own demise here, Rivera. From the top, from the second rope. Oh, look at that. He caught him right in the groin area. Supreme on the vicious Vic Grimes. Vic Grimes has the agility, but he must realize that to use it, he must be quick. And look at this Supreme following him up yes. to the top rope. Don't tell me, Rivera. Yes, He's is too bad. Oh, yeah. Huracarrara between five chairs. This is unbelievable. These two big men. One, two. Oh, he just barely slipped out of there. Just barely, Rivera. Big How grind. the hell did he kick out of it? Big Grind showing that almost a superhuman strength to be able to kick out. Oh, that fight chair, Hurricane Rana. Supreme. You got to give it up for this big man. I mean, he landed at Hurricane Rana beautifully. On to another big man, Rivera. Vicious Vic Grimes. As those five chairs still remain into, in the ring. And look at this. It looks like Vic Grimes may slam Supreme right on those chairs. It looks like with a power slam. Grimes. He says, that's it. Look at this. He's signaling for the end of the match. Grimes going upstairs now on the near side as Supreme is laid flat out in the center of the ring. This is like those steel chairs. the fourth or fifth trip of high altitude for Mr. Grimes. Oh, look at this. Oh, no, he missed. Ooh, that's, that's no good for the back. And look at this. Supreme oh. with a chair shot. And that's no good for the head. Did you hear that, Rivera? No kidding, I, man. Chico, I heard that. All the way in the back row. Unfortunately, I have to hear you. You went, oh yeah, brother, it's a pleasure for you. Consider it an honor and a pleasure for oh, yeah. you to be sitting at the sure. side uh -huh, of yeah. the Latin Rivera. Yeah, 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 whatever you say. Especially I, oh, here yeah. in the Olympic oh, yeah. Auditorium. I totally agree. As we see Wait Supreme getting ready for his ultimate trademark move. Watch, watch, watch. You see, the, he put it a little oomph. Two. Two. What, what the hell was that? Chico, the Wait a minute, the Angel, Angel pulled out Hernandez, and now Crack goes down, and Cronus is here, we saw these guys last week on XPW TV against Mexico's Most Wanted, what the hell are they doing here? Oye, tranquila, que está pasando aquí, everybody, everybody come down. Once again, another screw job, Rivera, from the Black Army, oh, double chair shot from Crack and Cronus on the Supreme, and look at this. Relax, relax, Chico. Nothing relax. is wrong. Right. Everything is okay. He got him. Three, it's over. And that's... So what are you saying? That Angel, Angel came and pulled the referee out? Angel? I don't even want to say it, Rivera. Angel planted one on Hernandez. Oh. Again? Again? What do you know? Did you see him in the men's room earlier or something? No, no, no. Oh, yeah. yeah, oh, where were you? Where were you, Rivera? Rivera. You have to relax with this. I think you better relax. Look at the head of Supreme Chick. 
Look at that. Busted wide open. Busted and open. robbed. Robbed by the Rob Black Army. The Once open. again, these guys, these are your buddies, Rivera. Everybody is my buddy in the SPW, right? Yeah, especially Only fun. Angel. Only fun. Everybody. You, Chico, you and Angel, I see you in the parking lot. Every once in a while, walking back to the car, hey, hey, going hey, home hey, after hey, the Olympics. Okay, come on, let's hear some more made-up stories. Hey, you, don't con to, eso. you don't have to defend yourself just because I caught you there, Tranquila buddy. Tí. Now look at Crack. Crack hovering over Supreme. And this is what I'm talking about, the Black Army. I mean, blackballing just about everybody who doesn't join the alliance of Rob Black. <laughs> oh, wait a minute. Do you hear the music, Larry? Let's, let's go. Oh, there he is. It's New Jack. You see him come out of the curtains. He's coming out. And look at this. He's taking it right to Angel. Angel stands no chance against there he is, the man. New Jack. Oh, and he's brought his toys, Rivera. That's right. Once again, this, this man with the questionable background, Chico. You have to question the background of this individual. Protus goes down. He is crazy. He's a lunatic, Chico, escaped from a mental asylum, the New York. Man, when, you're just bitter because the Black Army's getting their right. When you look at the face of this New York, Chico, you look at that, that's the face of, of, a, of a maniac. What about the face of Angel, man? He's in the Black Army crack. All these morons. Oh, look at that Supreme with the guitar right to the head of Vic Grimes. Hell yeah, Rivera. Hell yeah. Hey, will you relax for a second, Chico? This I'm is not going to relax. This is not the end of the world. Raw Black Army, Raw Black, you're getting just what you deserve right here. Look at this Supreme and New Jack taking it to all members of the Black Army in the ring right now. Oh, yeah, Supreme with a golf club. I can't know. Please, God wow. Is trying to fight back. Oh, this staple gun. Staple gun. And look at this Supreme choking out Crack with that golf club. Crack wishes that golf club was somewhere else. Oh, look at this. Staple gun again. Supreme making good use of that nine iron, Chief. New Jack coming to save the day for Supreme. The man who was robbed. Look at that chair shot from Supreme on the crack. Oh, no. Oh. John Cronus taking a big deal of punishment on the forehead. Shades of Abdul the Butcher there with that fort right to the forehead of John Cronus as Supreme goes to work with that trash can. Cronus trying to fight back, however. Oh no, look at this, Cronus has a staple gun. New Jack, being pummeled now by John Cronus. You gotta remember Supreme. Oh, look at that, Supreme and New Jack outnumbered, unfortunately, by the Black Army. High impact trash can across the head of New Jack. Good to see of, of John Cronus. Oh no, look at this, look at this. He's, cut, he's cutting him with that wood, that splintered wood coming out of the guitar. That was broke over the head of Big Grimes early on by Supreme and cutting away now at New Jack. New Jack temporarily dazed and confused in the corner as a result of the trash can by Cronus. Ooh. Look at that, right to the face of John Cronus as the fighting continues on the outside of the ring. Supreme, Big Grimes. Inside of the ring, New Jack. John Cronus, crack. And look at this, taking it right. Oh, look out behind you. New Jack, Crack's got that. What is he doing? Oh, look at New Jack taking it to Crack. The fighting on the outside of the ring as well, Rivera. Look at look at Big Brides with a cheese grater on the head of Supreme. This is nuts. Cheese grater. Why, why, what is this world coming to when you put the cheese grater on the forehead? What is that? You're going to put that on your spaghetti, like parme parmesan, on the chair. Rivera, Vic Grimes is getting exactly what he deserves. Man, Supreme had this match won in the first place. New Jack, Supreme taking it to the Rob Black Army still. And look, oh, look at this, he's got a, he's got a pool cue. We've seen him use this before. And look at this, right to the back of Vic Grimes. You know, Chico, these, these guys are mixing the old... The old classic game like the golf and billiard with pro wrestling. Can you believe it? Another innovation. Only in XPW. By XPW.
Supreme now coming back to the ring along with New Jack in the Black Army in shambles. Crack, Angel, Vic Grimes, John Cronus. Oh wait, what is this? What is this? Look at this Supreme and New Jack with the ladder yeah, and a table. Setting off the table. Wait, he's got two tables up there. New Jack has a table and Supreme has a table. They have to be careful because that metal grating maybe be the hole big enough for the table to go through. And what the hell do these two have in mind now? Supreme and New Jack setting these two tables and don't forget about that ladder that we saw right next to the ladder right there that we saw next to the tables that they're setting up here on the aisleway headed down to the ring. Oh. The concrete floor here at the Olympic Auditorium. Do you see that ladder, Chico? And, and it's no question in your Look mind at the size of it. That high altitude is going to play a big part of this scenario. Look at this, the size of that ladder. Oh no, New Jack. Going upstairs, Supreme. Setting up Kraken Angel on the tables. For some reason, I thought it would be the New Jack climbing on that ladder. Chico. At this point in time, it looks like Kraken Angel are having the time for their lives. But that's about to change! Ooh. Big, big leg drop. And did you see it connect right to the back of Angel's head? Angel's face went crashing right through that table onto the concrete floor. That ladder has to be 15, 20 feet. With no give. No give whatsoever. Angel and crack. New Jack from the top of that ladder. Did you see that, Rivera? Supreme, exalting. And big, even though he lost the match. Even though he got robbed, Rivera, and you know it. He's exalting in the victory right now, but it is temporary, chick. Admit it, Rivera, that he got robbed in that matchup. Admit it, Rivera. Flipping malarkey, that's what that match was? Gosh. Chick, what do you, what do you smoke? What do you drink? The milk, 2%. Yeah. My life. Peanut butter. Forget about that, chick. The bottom line is simple and plain. Plain it out, never mind. The winner of the match, fair and square, Big Grimes. Yo, whoa, 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 whoa. Listen, man, Supreme was beat by Big Grimes, Cronus, and Crack, and Angel planting one on referee Patrick Hernandez. A little smoochy, smoochy. Ooh. I, I, even, I even saw a little... A little tongue. Esperate, oye, esperate oh. con eso. If you realize, if you watch, you notice that Patrick Hernandez was the one going after the angel, too. What are you talking about? You gotta be kidding me. Listen, wherever you're from, that that uh, that may be okay. But here in the good old United States of America, we have something called consent. That's right, Chico. Consent. And maybe Angel was trying to reassert his masculinity after being pummeled by Lady Victoria. Well, Chico, the, the star have been telling me. No, don't there start. Is, there is a match already signed, sealed, and delivered for the redemption at the May 26th at the Olympic Auditorium that is going to feature Angel and Lady Victoria. But it's going to be one on one, Chick. Oh man! And Angel takes on Lady Victoria. What a match that's going to be! And he is going to get his ass kicked on Saturday night, May 26th, at the Grand Olympic Auditorium. What a night it's going to be Saturday night! Once again, May the 26th, 8 p.m. in downtown L.A. Of course, tickets are on sale right now at Ticketmaster. Charge by phone 213-480-3232. You can go to Ticketmaster.com and, of course, all the Ticketmaster outlets here in Southern California, or you can get tickets strictly through XPW. You can come to the XPW offices, 11133 Van Owen Street. Call the XPW offices, 755-8757 in the 818 area code. And don't forget about XPWrestling.com. Saturday night, May the 26th. At 8 p.m., the Grand Olympic Auditorium in downtown L.A. What a night it's going to be. Ladies and gentlemen, SPW fan, a show truly not to be missed. You do not want to miss out on catching all of your favorite SPW stars. The Messiah, Sabu, 
The list goes on and on, like the World War III chick. So don't miss it out. Tune in next week as we bring you more information about this great show redemption. Saturday, May 26th at the Olympic Auditorium. Until then, my name is Larry Rivera, the host of the show. I'm the host. host. Dorco Clocco, como te I already forget. We will see you next week. XPW fans, until then.